Good evening everyone. Welcome to another episode of the Avocado Insider series. It's your host Harshit Kodha. In this episode, we continue our discussion with Dr. Roberto Nathan. He was the former extension officer of the extension service at the Israeli Agriculture Ministry. And uh, he talks about intercropping in avocado farming. If you have any questions about commercial avocado farming, post your questions in the comment section down below and I'll ask the experts those questions and come back to you with a reply or create a separate video about it. So my next question is, can we intercrop and grow something in between the rows? Because farmers here uh, don't want to wait for three years after they have planted the trees to get something out of the orchard. So what are your suggestions regarding that? That's a problem. That's a problem. First of all, in Israel, we don't do that. Yes, I've seen that. <laughs> I know you have seen <laughs> We don't do that. Okay. In other countries, it's a common practice for the same reason that you mentioned. The problem with that is that uh, the irrigation and the nutrition requirements are different. If you intercrop, you're adding a crop that has totally different. So if you work, you just dismiss it. You don't consider the other crop. You work like what avocado, for avocado, the other crop will not be will not success, will not be a success. But if uh, you work for I'm, like forever, you put in the middle, yeah. uh, the avocado will suffer. So, uh, like my question is, uh, I'm not talking about firstly uh, permanent crops. I'm talking about vegetables that are like you grow for first three years and then you take it out. And I'm talking about for the space in between the rows where you know the practice yes, I, I understood perfectly and that's exactly yeah. what i meant okay vegetables so. grow at the different they have a different growth rate than avocado they have totally different requirements i'm not talking about tomatoes and not about whatever i'm talking generally have totally different water and nutrient requirements than avocado so if you're grow if you grow avocado grow avocado if you grow vegetables, grow vegetables. Both, it's not this and not this. So that's the reason why nobody does it in Israel. And there is a reason for that. It's not a cultural thing and not a religious thing. It just doesn't work, it doesn't work. So, because you will damage, it's a compromise. And uh, don't compromise. Do, the, do your best. I hope you found the video interesting and insightful. Thank you for watching. That's it for this video. But please don't forget to subscribe. I'm posting regular content these days. So whenever I post something new, if you have subscribed, you'd automatically get notified.